Oh, my son's first suit. I was born female, and I currently am still technically female. I've uh, I've always been a boy. I mean, playing sports and dressing like a boy, acting like a boy. We treat people all across the transgender spectrum, particularly transsexual individuals. At a very early age, one begins to have an inkling that one is a boy or one is a girl. It is not uncommon for a child of two or three to have this sense of the body not feeling right. This is what little kids will say, something is wrong with me. Uh, these are very common things for tra transsexual kids to experience. I couldn't live as a girl anymore. You know, I need to start being me because I've been pretending to be somebody else that's not me for the last, you know, 14, 15 years. So we want to be very careful when we work with children not to push anything on these children who may in fact grow up to be transsexual. Still, we want to be extremely conservative because we don't know how this child will turn out. On the other hand, we don't want to squash the child's, what seems to be the child's natural tendencies. You just know kind of thing that you're stuck in the wrong body and you were born, you were supposed to be born in the opposite sex. And so now you have to reassemble your inside to match the outside. It is a genetic condition and every serious medical doctor, research scientist studying this field of transsexualism realizes that this has nothing to do with learning. If it was a choice, um, I wouldn't pick being trans because of the complicated journey that it is. So I wish that I was born the correct gender to begin with. But because that didn't happen, obviously, you know, I have to go through this journey.